coach, obviously a spirited game. Yeah, you know what, I'm, I was happy with the way our guys battled hard and, and competed, and that was the biggest thing. We knew it was going to be a grind getting shorthanded again with Patrick McCarron leaving the game, but that was probably one of the one of the worst referee games we've had all year long. Just didn't have control, uh, made some real bad calls down the stretch, just fed off their bench's energy and, and them yelling and screaming, and he panicked and, and raised his arm. We battled through that. So it was great to see our PK stand tall there. Uh, unbelievable job at the end as well, and, and uh, real proud of our guys. Yeah, I was going to say, PK was outstanding, six for six. Yeah, you know what, and then they had some pretty good looks too. Uh, Pat Nagel, obviously your goaltender's got to be your best penalty killer, and he was. He was a difference tonight for us for sure, and our guys had great stick detail, and you could see them selling out there at the end, just, you know, kind of leave, leaving it all out there, it, you know, is one of those things we talk about, and, and the guys diving and, and blocking pucks and, and selling their bodies out uh, on the PK, just great to see. Special day with the Hockey Hall of Fame here in Toledo. These wins are fun for the guys, especially for the guys getting inducted tonight. Yeah, unbelievable. You know, it's nice to to have a spirited game because that's every single game that they played, and that's that's the way it was. It was physical. It was tough hockey. Uh, you look at the highlights of that uh, the, the goal scoring. It was good goal scoring too. They had it kind of all back then, and so to have a, a tight game like it was tonight, uh, physical contest. Uh, you know, a lot of special teams. Uh, the biggest thing is is making the making the Hall of Famers, making the guys that pave the way for our guys now make them proud that uh, they played here in Toledo and they can still be proud of the team that's here right now tomorrow big chance to get six points it is it's, it's an opportunity uh, we're, we're extremely shorthanded extremely shorthanded and we aren't going to hide that fact we've got tired guys in that locker room but um, I expect a gutsy performance again we're, we're going to be facing a Greenville team that's going to be hungry um, so we have to make sure that we're responsible with the puck and responsible in our coverage and and uh, you know see what we have left in the tank thanks for your time good luck tomorrow thank you